Louv Museum, Abu Dhabi. The Louv Abu Dhabi is an art and civilization museum located in Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates. The museum was inaugurated on 8 of November 2017 by French President Emmanuel Macron, United Arab Emirates Vice President Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, and Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nayyan. The museum is part of a 30-year agreement between the city of Abu Dhabi and the French government. The museum is located on the Zadiyat Island Cultural District. It is approximately 24,000 square meters or 260 square feet in size with 8,000 square meters or 86,000 square feet of galleries, making it the largest art museum in Arabian Peninsula. The final cost of the construction is expected to be about 600 million euro. In addition, 525 million US dollars was paid by Abu Dhabi to be associated with the Louvre name. An additional 747 million US dollars will be paid in exchange of art loans, special exhibition, and management advice. The theme of the current exhibition is Rendezvous in Paris, wherein it will bring you to the 20th century to see how the artists used to live and work together in Paris. You will see the art of František Kupka, who is famous in Fuvisa, Pablo Picasso, who is famous in Kibisa, Marcia Gaul, who is famous in Surrealism, and Amideo Modigliani, he is famous in Yusin from Kibisa. On this vlog, you will see the 10,000 years of luxury wherein you can see world history of lavish and luxurious through 350 extraordinary objects from fashion, jewelry, art, furniture, Design and more, including the oldest pearl in the world. For today's video, I'm very, very excited because we are here in Louvre Museum, Abu Dhabi. So, why we are here? The most important thing that we are going to discover today is to see the oldest pearl in the world and how old it is. Is it 400 years old? Or, or 1,000 years old. So if you are interested, let us find out. So come on and let's go. So over here we are buying our ticket. This is our ticket and Louvre and we're paying 60 dirham each. This is the general admission. So we will see now how beautiful the place is. Hello, Good afternoon. Hello. Thank Good afternoon. you. Enjoy. Thanks. Fragment of a rock face decorated with stylish face or mask, a raised arm, and an axe. Saudi Arabia about 2000 BCE. So look at that floor. This is UAE coastline map. It's time for family photo. <laughs> Monumental statue with two heads is said to be one of the oldest known to mankind. This statue is among the earliest large-scale representation of a human form. Oxo civilization is the modern archaeological designation for a Bronze Age civilization of Central Asia.
Ramses II, also known as Ramses the Great, he is often regarded as most powerful parao of the new kingdom. Tutankhamun was an ancient Egyptian parao who was the last of his royal family to rule during the end of the 18th dynasty. Gedea, Prince of Lagash, was the political and religious governor of Lagash in southern Mesopotamia. I am thrilled to see the mummy bandage with an extract from the Book of Dead, Egypt around 300 BCE. Vizier Rachnir was an ancient Egyptian noble and official of the 18th dynasty who served as the governor of the town. Hinothoe was an Egyptian princess and priestess during the 21st dynasty. In Greek tradition, the Sphinx has the head of a woman, the hunches of a lion, and the wings of a bird. In the history of warfare, Achaemenid Empire, also known as the First Persian Empire, was known for its elite force for the warriors, named by Herodotus, the Immortals. Hey guys, so in this area, I'm gonna show you the different types of coin. This is like a birth of coinage. Wing Dragon Northern China is a symbol of power, strength, and good luck for people. Cleopatra VII Philopator was the last active ruler of the Ptolemy Kingdom of Egypt. Legend relates that the true cross was found by Saint Helena, mother of Constantine the Great, during her pilgrimage to the Holy Land about 326. <music> Guanyin, she was the first given the appellation of Goddess of Mercy or the Mercy Goddess by Jesus missionary in China. The Aztec religion originated from the indigenous Aztecs of central Mexico. Like other Mesoamerican religions, it also has practices such as human sacrifice in connection with many religious festivals which are in the Aztec calendar.
The use of the Mass in rituals or ceremonies is a very ancient human practice across the world, although Mass can also be worn for protection, in hunting and in sport, in feast or in wars, or simply used as ornamentation. The statue of Lacoon and his son, also called the Lacoon Group, has been one of the most famous ancient sculpture ever since it was excavated in Rome in 1506 and placed on public display in the Vatican where it remains. This towering pair of plaster statues created by Italian sculptor Antonio Canova illustrate the heroic virtues that characterize the spirit of the 18th and early 19th century ancient fight. As you walk around 10,000 years of luxury, a vast new exhibition at Louvre Abu Dhabi, it is hard at times not to feel amazed, mesmerized and proud because you are able to see the luxurious stuff from jewelry, clothing, tapestry, musical instrument, furniture and cutlery. <music> The Far Reaches of Luxury is to showcase the luxurious items from China and Japan. In China, you will see the luxury of the aristocracy and the scholar class consisted of the position of Chinese antiques from Song Dynasty and Qing Dynasty. Super small. One of the most exciting part of our tour is to see the paintings of Pablo Picasso who is famous in Cubism art style and whom I can see and read his work via books only but now I can able to see his artwork in person that makes me feel happy and proud. On the other 
hand, we have Prantishek Kupka, who is famous in Fubisem art style. Marshagal and Surrealism art style. And Antonio Modigliane, who is famous in Primitivism art style. Along your journey, you will encounter a lot of artworks from different artists. at this beautiful ceiling over here it's like a bird nest so thank you for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this video and see you in my next vlog bye